I can't take it anymore, little robots. Can't take what anymore? So it's gonna be like that, huh? That's how it's gonna be? What are you doing here? Is the... Is this Meisner? I don't know what that is! Mars, I have no idea what you're mad about. Did I pass the audition or not? Audition? Oh, you just gotta twist the knife, don't you? The power's gone to your head, man. Fine, you want me to say it? I'll say it. Can I join home base? Yeah, dude. I thought you already did. Oh. Well, I need a lab. All right. Thank you. Hey, what's up, everyone? It's Beth from Two Nerds on a Couch here, bringing you another episode of Save the World. Just as a reminder, this is a no commentary playthrough. If you like this video, go ahead and hit that thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Thank you very much and enjoy the show. You know how we're always coming up with gadgets to outsmart the storm? Well, that started an arms race. You know those rumors we've been hearing about an even more dangerous part of the storm? A corrosive storm that closes in on you, eventually swallowing you alive? Remember how I said that would never, ever, ever happen here? It's happening here. We need to retrieve the data as usual, but this time we need to watch the storm. Exposure to the storm will hurt you. A lot. You'll take damage when you're in the storm, so keep an eye on your health. We need to retrieve the data before we're overwhelmed by the storm, so you'll want to move quickly. We only have 20 minutes. Keep an eye on the storm's movement on your map. Let's keep an eye out for anything Lars might need for his lab. We've got a bonus in play. Need that. So tell me about this lab, Lars. Well, your weather balloons are perfect for the short-term forecast. But I was thinking I'd dip my toe into the old advanced storm recon slash R&D pond. Ooh, nice. Over here! Help! So wait, are you a scientist or a musician? I could be two things, little robot. Yeah, but no offense, I am not building a state-of-the-art lab for a musician. Fair enough. My touring days are far behind me, so let's just say scientist. Like you. site. The location of the landing site has been added to your map. Any attacks from the storm's creatures could corrupt the data. You'll want to build defenses around the balloon's landing site.
Thank you. before the storm storms convenient well there were four of us working together i studied unique storm formations my buddy carlos was a star stalker my man sid was into dirt stuff and anthony was a chemist when he wasn't off causing trouble I found the landing site. The location of the landing site has been added to your map. Any attacks from the storm's creatures could corrupt the data. You'll want to build defenses around the balloon's landing site. Hold on! You're Lars! The Lars! You're just now putting it together? I... I'm wearing the shirt, little robot. You are in steel wool? Yeah, depends on how you feel about building a state-of-the-art lab for a musician. Straight up, I will build you two! You want two? I'll push pause on Operation Hospital! Just one'll do. So, are we building a research facility slash recording studio for steel wool? Unless you know something I don't, I'm afraid it's just me. Oh. But, maybe if we keep up the fight, we'll all find our friends. I can't believe it. You're the best. The only way we're going to retrieve all of the data is to shoot the balloon down as soon as possible. So bring down that balloon, download that data, and get ready to move. The balloon has landed. Defend that data.
Data's looking good. Looking good. Another file. Thank you. You've been wonderful. Looking good. Worthy job, Commander. So, a uh, good job. The data you collected will help us locate survivors and weak points in the storm. Help! Well, that's everything I need. It's not steel wool, but. Welcome to our band of survivors. Happy to be here. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to use code tuners on a couch in the item shop and hit that subscribe button. Thanks again and we'll see you next time.